MDOT tries very hard to limit highway construction inconvenience over holiday weekends. But this Memorial Day, traffic restrictions on some of the most disruptive West Michigan projects will not be lifted. 13 on your side, reporter Phil Dawson is live in Grand Rapids to explain why not, Phil. Well, Nick, some projects like the reconstruction of I-196 over the Grand River are just too massive, too involved. It's not possible to move the barrels and the cones out of the way and let traffic flow freely for a few days. For each major holiday during construction season, we'll lift as many restrictions as we, as we possibly can. And that means out of 131 highway construction projects underway around the state, MDOT is temporarily lifting traffic and lane restrictions over the holiday weekend at 90 of them. We do that every for every major holiday just to make it easier travel day for, you know, for the holiday weekend. But traffic delays and detours will remain at 41 projects around the state, several big ones in West Michigan. There's five major projects still being worked on in West Michigan over the holiday weekend. And the ones to watch out for in this area are Westbound 196 over the Grand River and of course the big reconstruction of 96 and 196 by the Beltline. And then out to the west, you've got the work in Hudsonville, you've got work on 96 and Crockery Creek, work on M120, and then to the east, there's work in Portland. But while restrictions will remain at six sites, West Michigan traffic will flow freely at many others over the holiday weekend. Yeah, we are lifting 20, 20 out of 26 projects in the Grand Region. And MDOT allows for these interruptions in the construction timetable for each project. Stopping work for holidays shouldn't delay the estimated time of completion. Yeah, yeah, everything's on schedule. Well, the weather's been somewhat cooperative. It's been pretty wet, but uh, as far as I know, we're still on schedule. MDOT will lift the lane restrictions at 3 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. They'll go back into effect at 6 on Tuesday morning. And the complete list of all 131 construction projects across the state and what travelers can expect when they get there is posted on the MDOT webpage. Nick? All right, Phil, thank you. A 